वेलकम टू दी चैनल सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू क्रिएट फेसबुक एड्स रीमार्केटिंग कैंपेन इन अ मेटा एड्स मैनेजर सो फर्स्ट जस्ट क्लिक ऑन क्रिएट चूज द ऑब्जेक्टिव एज अ सेल्स क्लिक ऑन कंटिन्यू चूज द मैनुअल सेल्स कैंपेन एंड क्लिक ऑन कंटिन्यू गिव द कैंपेन नेम एज अ रीमार्केटिंग हियर वी हैव सिलेक्टेड अ कैंपेन ऑब्जेक्टिव एज अ सेल्स Our user catalog is on, and we have selected the catalog, a Shopify product catalog. Just go to the ad set level. Give the name as a remarketing. Choose the performance goal. So this will be the remarketing conversion campaign. Then just click on maximum number of conversions. Here conversion event will be purchase. Here we have to select the product set. We will be selecting the product sets, the one we created the last time on a video, how to create the product sets. If you haven't watched that video, just click on I button or uh, find the link in the description. So I will be selecting the product set that is all product in stock, new one, this one. Choose the daily budget. I will be choosing the daily budget as a 700. This is the important setting that you need to understand for a remarketing. So first. Here we will be choosing the retarget ads to the people who already interacted. And here we will be choosing view or add to cart but not purchase. So the objective of this campaign is to retarget those people who have added particular product to the cart or viewed particular product on our website but they haven't purchased that particular product yet. So we will be taking the audience of last 180 days. Here just give the ad name as ad1. Our Facebook page is selected, just choose the Instagram page. Here ad format will be carousal. Under carousal card, we have catalog cards. Choose a single image. If you have multiple images in your product feed, go with a slideshow. I would recommend going with a slideshow option because this is a retargeting ad. If someone has added particular product to the cart or viewed particular product and showing the multiple images of the same product might persuade that particular person to purchase that particular product. Our headline will be product name. Add the primary text. I will be adding a primary text here. Call to action is a shop now. In a destination, I will go ahead with the advantage destination and in a website URL, I will just add the website URL. In a display link, you can just add the display link, the one you want to show in the ad. Here in a deep link to the website option, just click on a particular add a catalog field, choose the URL, select this particular option and check this URL encoding and your error will get sorted. Here under tracking, we have to choose the pixel and just build the URL parameters to track the campaign on Google Analytics. So just add the campaign source, medium, campaign name and a campaign content. Just click on apply. So we are all good to go. Just close this. Click on review and publish. So just publish this particular campaign. So you can see here our remarketing campaign got published. So this is how we create a Facebook ads remarketing campaign in a meta ads manager. If you find this video useful, do like, comment, share and subscribe. And if you have any doubts, do comment below. Till then, goodbye.